Russians unsuccessfully trying to advance towards Kupiansk. Russian troops are trying to break through Ukraine's defenses in the Kupiansk direction, seeing no success. That's according to Deputy Minister of Defense, Hanna Malia, who reported the news on Telegram. As of now, the main direction of the enemy's offensive remains in the Kupiansk area. Here, the enemy has formed an offensive group and is trying to advance but without success, she said. According to Malia, the operational situation is difficult but under control. The defense forces of Ukraine are courageously holding back the enemy's offensive there. She added that the Russians have been conducting unsuccessful offensive actions in the Sinkivka district of Kharkiv region for several days already. The enemy's objective in the Kupiansk direction is to break through the defenses of our troops and move directly to Kupiansk. The intensity of combat operations and enemy shelling is high. In some positions, there are several changes of positions per day. All necessary decisions to strengthen our stability were quickly made on the ground by commanders and higher command of the eastern group of troops, the deputy minister added. At the same time, according to her, in the direction of Bakhmut, we continue to carry out offensive actions on the southern flank around the town of Bakhmut, getting hold of the gained positions. The enemy is going for constant assaults to try to restore their lost positions on the outskirts of Klishivka and in the Zaitsev area. Both in the east and in the south, the enemy is currently suffering significant losses in terms of manpower, weapons and equipment. Our defense forces have significantly reduced the offensive and defense potential of the enemy these days and are preventing them from implementing their plans, said Malia. As reported, the defense forces of Ukraine continue their offensive operation in the Bakhmut, Melitopol and Berdyansk directions, seeing partial success in the direction of Urozain, Pryutny and Vobov.